So hi, uh, I'm Brian Fairbrother, I'm a handicap chairman at Denton Golf Club and um, this is primarily aimed at Denton Golf Club members, however um, I know other people watch these. So what we're talking about, well we're talking about um, the World Handicap System, WHS, and it was interesting, I saw this poll last week and uh, it was simple, it was a uh, world handicap system, do you love it, you hate it, you don't understand it. And it was about like 40% um, were saying that they loved it, 40% said they hated it, and 20% um, said they don't understand it. It's really interesting this. I replied back to it. And I just said, I'd be asking simple questions. If you hate it, why do you hate it? And if you don't understand it, why do you don't understand it? So let's go to the hate bit first. If people remember Kongu, um, everybody hated Kongu. Not many people liked it. People didn't like the idea of um, getting the point one back if they were playing bad. They knocked a shot out of bounds on the second hole. They said, that's my day over with now. I'm getting point one back. Might as well in our. People didn't understand Kongu. People used to regularly call me and say, can't understand why my handicap's gone up, got point one back. Played really well, better than my handicap. Where did you play? Played at such and such a course. What did you have? You shot such a score. Well, do you not realise that that course is a standard scratch, 68, against a par of 71? You have to play three shots better than your handicap. Um, otherwise, you are threatening to be even outside the buffer zone. Amazingly, the buffer zone, everybody complained about the buffer zone. Buffer zone's not big enough, um, things like that. People complained about 54 handicaps in Kongu. Amazing, yes, 54 handicaps were brought in under Kongu, not in WHS. So there we go. So these haters of the system, the thing what we're trying to say is about world handicap system, what is it you hate? Um, do you hate it because you don't understand it? I personally love the system. I think it gives you the ability to go out there, you can knock a ball out of bounds on the second hole, and you're not immediately resigned to failure. Because you could still put in a score, which is above your handicap, but it might not be a counting score and it may never count whereas under the old Kongu system you got your point one back and that certainly counted straight away so what I'm saying to people at Denton is if you hate the system well approach me tell me what you hate about it let's discuss it let's see is your hate really down to the fact that you don't quite understand it now for the people who don't understand the system well are you aware that at Denton is that um, there's a help desk? That's me. <laughs> um, you can always call myself or even Steve Glenwright, the competitions chairman, and we will talk to you about what you don't understand about the system. Um, come to us. Uh, we have the email address where you can put a written query in to say, look, I've done this, I've done that, and so on. Um, Many members do use it. I get lots of uh, cards from uh, outside of the UK. And I actually submit them for people. Now, some people say, this uh, new system's rubbish. World Handicap System, I can't submit scores. You could never submit scores under Kongu. You can submit scores under World Handicap. The thing is, you have to submit them via myself, certainly for Denton. Um, and I can input them on the system for you. Now, in future reiterations of the My England Golf app, 
you will actually be able to submit um, scores from Scotland and Wales yourself using the MyEG. And then eventually you will be able to do that if ever French you play in Spain. So these are things you could never ever do under Kongu. This wonderful system that people hated but magically want it back. Amazing, isn't it? So all I'm saying is, if you don't understand the system, please contact us and we'll help you understand. Uh, we've put loads of videos out before the system came into place and I personally put some newsletters out. If you hate the system, well, tell us what you hate about it. Might have some surprises for you, you never know. So there you go, folks. Um, thanks for listening and um, have great golfing.